Hi, it's my time to shine. How's you doing? I hope you're great. I will be doing full love readings for the full moon sign of Capricorn. This will be for all signs. This will be earth, air, fire, and water. Period. I will be getting a tooth pull on Monday and getting some replaced and installed. So I will not be doing readings. It might be for the whole week next week. I'm not sure. For Sunday and Saturday, I'm going to try to post as many as I can up. My regular plus some so I could just spread them out for the week for you guys. You feel what I'm saying? Is it going to be money manifestation next week? I don't know. I will not know that until the day I wake up. I don't know how my mouth's going to feel. I might do them Saturday. I might not do them next week. I don't know. I will let you know. Don't worry about that. Um, I'm going to be starting out with the fire signs. That will be Sagittarius. That will be Aries. That will be Leos. We want to see what's the love energy surrounding you guys. This will be for relationships and love readings period um for the full moon in cancer what i can say cancer well cancer moon is still here but i say full moon in capricorn my opposite sign so we will go ahead and we're going to start off with the fire signs and we're going to see what's the energy say for resonate always leave the rest this reading could be for bisexual straight confused however it come out always know you can get a personal read and everything's in the description box make sure you thumbs up and hit the like button if you love my content i am having specials full readings 50 dollars. period full video reads so we're going to go ahead and that's going to be to september the 15th 2022 and then it'll be over so we're going to go ahead and we're going to see what's the energy that's surrounding the fire sign Sagittarius, Aries, and Leo for their love life for the full moon that's in Capricorn at this time. Whenever you see this reading, it's meant for you, but we know when the full moon ends. If you don't, Google it. It will tell you. So we're going to move ahead. We have the hangman reversed. So somebody... And this card here, this is the card. Ain't they pretty? Look like they coming up out of being stuck in a situation that they put their self in. And this is a masculine energy. Um, the way I see this is that you may be taking care of a grown ass man. Bottom line energy, this literally is going towards a masculine. Like all they do is sit home with their hand in their pants while you working, busting your ass is the energy. And you're about to come up out of that energy and take care of a grown man. You're getting tired with the hangman. This is somebody stuck in a situation that this is where they want to be in. They don't want to work. They want you to take care of the condom. This could be a feminine as well. Take what resonates, always eat the rest. We want to see what else come out here. What is the energy surrounding the fire signs? For full moon and Capricorn. Yeah, somebody's tired of taking care of somebody grown. And basically, they're going to have to get off their ass. It's the energy for the fire signs. It's just too much. I feel you. We have Queen of Cups. So, somebody emotions. Somebody offers somebody some love here. Like, like they love this person here. But with all this water here, is a lot of emotions. Because it's just like, I'm taking care of this grown man. It's just a lot here. And, or... For some, somebody could be offering somebody else that they don't got to take care of new love here. With the two of cups here, maybe you see yourself growing old with this person. So maybe it's somebody you with that you're taking care of. And maybe they realize that and maybe they coming up out of being lazy. You feel what I'm saying? Because this person is offering you the same thing. And you definitely see um, with the two of cups, this is this could be forever with this person, but something's got to change. Is the energy that I'm seeing here? What is the energy surrounding the fire signs? Love reading for the full sign of Capricorn for the moon. Holy spirits, what is the energy? Okay, with the three of swords in the future, 
Yeah, something's definitely going to end here. Like I said, like somebody may have found somebody else for some others. Three of Swords, somebody may have a third party here. You may be at work and this masculine could be doing him. You see his phone near him. It can't be you if you at work. And you want to offer somebody else some type of love here. So this third party situation or maybe you're taking care of somebody you found out you're in a third party situation. But I see this energy is ending here. Yeah. It's going to be some endings in somebody love life. For the fire signs, full moon and Capricorn. Somebody like, oh, I'm not dealing with that shit. Y'all know I don't do love readings. Appreciate this. I got so many cards, I just choose not to do love, y'all. With the page of swords here. This is usually the card of when somebody watching you or something. But if somebody here with this card here, somebody's getting some truth, some knowledge here. Somebody's reading a lot of books here. Um, maybe this person that you're taking care of decides they want to go back to school. But even if you want to go back to school and you're not working, you got to get a job here. So somebody may be smart here. Somebody may be book smart here. Somebody may be book smart here. On the past, they went to school, but they just like a bum now. Yeah. Somebody stay in balance here. Yeah, with the two of pentacles, somebody is balancing school work. It's like you you balancing everything and this person not. Like their excuse could be, oh, I can't go to school and I can't work. But you could sit home and be on your phone and playing with your PP or your vagina all day and watch a TV. You feel what I'm saying? That's the energy I'm getting here. Yeah. With the ten of cups here, I definitely feel like you happy here or you will be happy but i just don't think it's this person here because this person is stuck on they can't do nothing and you try to focus on your happiness here something some tears want to shatter here and then reverse we have the queen of pinnacles like your money you you starting to see a difference in your money with this person this, part, this person could be messing your money up here with the nine of pinnacles it's like you grow my money here they was messing up your money, but your money is growing in here. Capricorn Taurus Virgo energy. Like somebody could literally think you a money tree. I mean, take what resonate. At the bottom of the deck here, we have the high priestess. You're starting to see the light here. You 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 starting to see that like you, you're tired of offering. We even got the sun underneath reverse. Somebody's not happy here. Leo energy, this is the future energy as well. What is the energy surrounding the fire signs? Love reading for full moon and Capricorn here. That was a lot. Okay. So I got them up. Like the seven of wands. Like somebody's not even trying to hear nothing they saying. Um, somebody could be getting advice for friends. They coming up out of getting advice for friends about their happiness here with the three of pentacles reversed and the eight is that the eight and the eight of pentacles reverse yeah somebody can't build nothing with them and it's messing up their money here they can't they don't see themselves building nothing with them because it's taking their money away that's what i'm seeing that's what i'm definitely seeing for fire signs somebody's tired to take care of somebody here or somebody don't want to do something. Or this could just be you. Take what resonate. This could just be you. With the strength here, you could be dealing with a Leo here. And you're trying to have strength for a situation. Or Leo dealing with you here. But the overall energy is the page of wands. You're going to get some bad news. Or somebody is bad news. With the king of cups here, somebody got a lot of bullshit with them anyway. Period. You just don't see. Like I said, he home, he chilling, he on his phone, but you working and all this. They saying they can't do all of this. That's the energy I'm getting. With the five of cups, that's going to be a loss. Somebody's going to be breaking up. There's going to be an ending here. There's arguments and it's just too much going on here. That's what I'm saying for the fire signs. Like I said, moon, Capricorn moon, full moon brings a whole lot of emotions to the surface here. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to go ahead. We're going to clear it out with some love oracles here as well. This is for my fire signs, full moon, and Capricorn. Things come to a head is the energy. And that's what I may be naming this reading. Who 
Holy Spirits. What is the energy surrounding? Whoa, fire sauce. It came out. No reversals with my oracles. I need to focus on my healing. I feel that you will reject me. Yes, it is too late. So, yeah. it's a, it's a Things came to a head here. It, it just was too much. It's the energy I'm seeing. I'm going to give you one more oracle. Then I'm going to close out. But, yeah. Things came to a head. That's just how that shit did. And when it comes to a head, it bursts. Bottom line. So you already know. So let's see what's the energy. Holy Spirits, what is the energy surrounding fire signs? Dang, I fell straight on the floor. Talk in person. You may need to talk to somebody in person. You may be texting this person this information. Maybe because you at work and you start realizing some shit. You feel me? Or you're not around this person. Or this person be texting you. Like I see, they just chilling. You working, you going to school, you you balancing everything, this person not. Or you balancing the finances, this person not. It's starting to be a burden. And it says you need to talk in person. That's for some. Or this may be what you feeling, but you need to talk in person. Angel number five, look that up. Always could be the five. Five end up, to me, for me, is a loss. Five of cups is a loss. So we've seen that in your reading. Numbers don't lie. Somebody is stressed about something they lost, forgot the two cups that's standing. So this is for my fire signs. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. I hope things work out. Peace, I am blessings to you.